Hey there guys, my name is Rexby and welcome back to more Let's Play Danganronpa. We're currently preparing ourselves for the fourth trial, the trial to figure out who killed Sakura. So uh, that's the only skill I unlocked since then. Let's go ahead and start. Now I did talk last trial about changing the difficulty and then before this trial started I wanted to do it and then I figured out you can only do it at the start of a chapter so I will probably set the difficulty lower after this chapter if I struggle again with this trial but if I get through this trial without you know having too much trouble with the mini games, then we'll just leave it at the difficulty we're on currently. Anyway that's all the preparations let's go ahead and start. Okay, well, we've already heard the explanation. Basically, if we pick the wrong one, then all of us die and they get to graduate. But yeah. We don't need that explanation again. Basically, you know, we need to pick the right killer, else they get to go scot free and the rest of us are killed. So, where do we begin? Yeah, we've said that before and we're not always right, so I think it should still be good to go over all the evidence. Hmm. <laughs> Even if it was one of them, we need to know which one of them specifically. Yep, she's definitely seems sure. What's her reason for believing that? Well, uh, let's see here. Let's make her argument with Hina's account. Oh yeah, right, of course. She said that Sakura wanted to meet all of them. I don't think that's the only reason. What? Come on. See, I'm already not aiming right. But yeah, it definitely wasn't the only reason because they are also the ones that were met. Um, with Sakura. Come on. W why does it miss? Ah, I hate aiming in this game. There we go. Definitely lowering it because I'm just missing the thing when I know what to hit. Hmm. Yeah, that is a good reason to suspect them. So, did one of them do it? Are we maybe gonna move on to the next argument already? Well, apparently so. Let's see, we have the pocket trash. どう考えても怪しいよ。絶対あんたたちの中に犯人がいるんだよ。呼び出された I think Hero is the one that is lying. So yeah, let's uh let's see if we can shoot Hero's statement. Oh wait, that was Toko's? Oh come on, it's so unclear. If you're gonna change the ordering up, like of course ha. Ah. Okay, now I gotta figure out which is the newest statement because their ordering is very poorly placed. That's poor design. So that's the one. Uh, I really wish it was like Phoenix Wright where we could just choose a statement. Hagakure-kun 
な,なんで急にそんなこと言うんだべ赤い水玉模様って私がさくらちゃんにあげた飴の包装紙と一緒だいやそれはそのあの飴は倉庫に入れるようになった直後私が段ボールごと独り占めしてるからそれと同じものはもう倉庫にも残ってないはずだよ、exactly. だとしたら葉隠れくんはその飴をどこで手に入れたのかさくらちゃんからだそれしかないよえ,えー、っとそそのオーガからもらったのは確かだけどだけどもらったのはずいぶん前なんだだから事件とは関係ないんだって I don't believe you いつもらったの葉隠れくんが大神さんと最後に会ったのって朝比奈さんを保健室に連れて行った時だよねつ,つまりあの時より前にもらったってことだべ Hmm, what he said can't be right because s e r g e n can only have gotten the candy after the incident in the nurse shops. The reason I know is that is when s e g r a got that candy, s e g r a yeah, got the candy, yeah, when s e g r a got that candy. Yeah, sorry, hero, but you've already started lying. It's making you look quite suspicious. So, 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 Well, you denied doing it, and it's where the murder took place, so. Yes? Definitely he is. Well, so far, the person who starts getting hostile ends up being the one who did it, so your hostility is making you look more guilty in my eyes. Yeah, what proof do you have that it's Toko? Shining message. Oh, I know what the shining message is. Yep, there is Toko in, in blood, at least. Not sure if it's her blood, but there's Toko written in blood. Yeah, I don't think it's right because there was no blood found on Sakura's fingers. So, why would she wash off her own finger after writing it? That is true. Kyoko brings up a good point. The only people who investigated the scene of the crime were Byakuya after he insisted on it, Kyoko, myself, and, well, Hina. So, Toko and Yasuhiro did not get any time to investigate it, so he couldn't have seen it. Hmm, hold on. When Kyoko found the message, it was. It was on the magazine shelf, but it was upside down, right? Yeah, 
現場での捜査が始まった後でねだとするとさっきの葉隠れ君の発言っておかしいよねおおかしい何がおかしいんだべ何もおかしくねえっての No, there's definitely something strange. Kagan found a dying message during the investigation, in which case, it contradicts what Hiro told us. Oh, what's gonna happen? Another argument? This time using the magazine dying message. Hmm, he said when he, saw, he saw it when he first found the body. But at that time, where was the magazine? Huh, it's not Hero's statement? Then is it Kyoko's? That's weird. What? Okay, hold on. Hold on, hold on. We need to look at the fruit bullet for um for where is it? The magazine dying message. Okay, on the magazine shelf, one magazine had been put back upside down. Inside this magazine there's name had been written in blood. It's assumed you have a right to use their finger to do so. What what statement does that contradict then? They said it's not this one. I can tell you when I found the dying message. It was after the investigation. That's correct. Tucked away on the magazine. I don't know what the wrong thing is. So again, I had to use a flashback bullet, but even after I got that, I still couldn't hit it. I'm definitely turning it down because those like whispers and stuff are just getting annoying to me, and it's 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 impacting the amount of fun I have with this game. So next chapter, we are definitely going down to a lower difficulty. I'm just saying it now already because. <sighs> it, it, it's just starting to get frustrating and not fun. But yeah, when, when the body was found, the magazine was sitting on the shelf. Kirigiri-san <laughs> ま、待て。話を振り返んなって。俺がいつ見たかは問題じゃねえはずだ。オーガが残したバイキング創世時によると、犯人は深町で間違いねえはずだべ。な、なんかどっちから突っ込むべきかわからなくなってきた。それがあ
の占いは三割当たる。ナイス、I did it at one go。これで証明するよ。I'm happy with that. I'm usually really bad at these. 大神さんがあのダイイングメッセージを書いたとは考えられないよだってあのダイイングメッセージって指で書かれたみたいだったけどでも彼女の死体は両手とも綺麗なままだったあんねじゃあそのダイイングメッセージって誰が書いたのひょっとして科学力君が捏造したものだったりしてだからこそ彼はダイイングメッセージの存在を知っていたとか、うん、はいそうなんですあ認めたやっぱりそうだでもどうして捏造なんかそそれはその俺が王がを殺しちまったからだ Yep I expected as much I like how he just admits it though He's already admitting to killing her? Let's uh, hear this. Ogakarano,you'll <laughs> Uh, okay. Would you like a piece of candy? It might help give you some energy. Oh, sure. Thanks. This is it. I'm going to end it today. I'm going to end everything. オーガは俺を殺す気だって。俺を殺してここから出て行く気なんだって。ほらビビっちまって。そんでそんで。隙を見て近くの棚にあったモノクマボトルでオーガに殴りかかっちまったんだ。オーガの背後から不意の一撃を食らわしちまったんだべ。そうしたらオーガはぐったりしてそのまま動かなくなっちまった俺はそこで我に帰ってこのままじゃ処刑されちまうと思ってテーブルの上にあった雑誌に「不可は」って血文字を残してポンズらしたんだ迷惑よマジに値するわこれが今回の事件の全貌だべあとは煮るなり焼くなり好きにしてくれ。Hmm. So, a few things that still don't make sense. This never mentions Toko vomiting up blood or anything like that.、Um, it also only explains why one of the bottles is broken, whereas the shards we found were of two bottles. So, I feel like there is still more to it. Did maybe b i a k u y a or Toko come in later and actually finish her off? Where Hiro didn't actually kill her yet? I'm, I'm interesting. I'm interested to know. Let's、uh, keep going. I'm not sure what I'm doing. 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 今のハガクレ君の話だけでは説明のつかない彼の行動があったはずその説明を聞かない限りはまだ終われないわ What is it that doesn't make sense? What he would do, have to, had to do after writing the um why the magazine was hidden? Why he picked Toko? No, I think picking Toko makes sense Um, yeah, why did my cousin was him? So, you're a 
ハガクレ君が雑誌を隠したことの説明がなかったよね死体が発見された時ダイイングメッセージが書かれた雑誌は雑誌棚に戻されてたけどさどうしてわざわざ見つかりにくい雑誌棚に戻したのそれじゃ捏造の意味なんてないのにいやというかだな俺は隠してなんかねえぞちゃんとテーブルの上に置いといたはずだけど Which means someone else came in after hero だとすると、ハガクレ以外の誰かがあの雑誌を雑誌棚に戻したということになるな。つまり、事件前後に娯楽室を訪れた人物が他にもいたということか。やっおそらく、その考えで間違いないはずよ。その人物があの雑誌を隠したんだとするとそれはあのダイイングメッセージを見られると困る人物だったはず Well, um, Toko seems like the obvious choice これだ深川さんだよねえだってダイイングメッセージを見られて困る人って実際に名前を書かれた深川さん以外に考えられないよそうなのあんたも娯楽室に行ったのな,なんで私がいえそうじゃなくてそんなことはどうでもいいじゃない犯人はもう決まったんでしょさ,さっき葉隠れだってそう認めてたじゃないそうです俺がやりましたいや違うなんであんたが答えるのよハガクレ君が大神さんをボトルで殴ったのは確かだよでも事件はそれで終わりじゃなかったんだ終わりじゃなかったってつまりハガクレ君は犯人じゃないそう<笑>何言ってんのよそんなことありえないわよ Well you better believe it because、uh, there's evidence to point that just one bottle wasn't enough to take her down だったらもう一度ハガクレ君にさっきの話をしてもらいましょうかそうすればはっきりするはずよ彼が犯人じゃないってことがあのそれで俺はどうすれば今言った通りよもう一度大神さんを殴打した時のことを話してな,なんかわからんけど分かったべ、mm, We haven't reached the end of the case Hero is the real killer and we have to prove it So we're gonna get another argument. I think this is the one where we're probably gonna say, like,、um, oh, okay.、Uh, Kyoko's examination summary status of Sakura's body yellow powder. Let's just see what they say. Um, okay, I quickly want to see、um, in my treat bullets which one did mention s the t status of Sakura's body. Was slumping forward, traces of blood around her mouth.、Um, that might not be explained yet.、Uh, do we have the glass shards on the floor? Must have come from a bottle. That doesn't say enough.、Um, wait, what was、um, Kyoko's examination? s o c r a t e s suffered two blows, not one. So, yeah, that's the one that we want. That's the truth bullet that we need to get.、Um, how did we switch?、Uh, yeah. okay. uh, so, we want Kyoko's examination. I hit Oga from behind. I hit from behind. And he only hit her once. Okay. 
ハガクレ君のオーダーのせいで大神さんが死んだなら彼女の頭の傷が2つだったことの説明がつかないよ2つそう彼女の頭部の傷は2つだったのよ死体を触るのが趣味の女が言うんだ間違いないんだろうグッドヤクヤンブラッキューグリーでも俺が殴ったのは1回なのにどうして頭の傷が2つあるんだ実はオーダーが2回あったってことよしかもモノクマボトルによるオーダーだねちょっと待ちなさいよ頭の傷だけでどうしてそこまでわかるのオーダーが2回もあったなんてそれもモノクマボトルによるオーダーなんて手がかりは頭の傷だけじゃないあのモノクマボトルには明らかに不審な点があったその不審な点をはっきりさせることでモノクマボトルでのオーダーが2回あったと分かるのだ思い出してみ事件後の娯楽室の棚にも4本のモノクマボトルが残されていたでしょそれと床には1本分の破片とモノクマフィギュアが落ちていたわねハガクレ君が大神さんをオーダーした時に割ったボトルだよねつまりあの現場には4本のモノクマボトルと1本分の破片があったことになるけどでもモノクマボトルは全部で6本のはず1本足りないのもしてモノクマボトルが全部で6本だってわかるのよ What would make sense for the chest side of things, but also the weight of the broken bottle we found is more than the weight of a full bottle, so it implies that there are shards from another bottle there. Simple. That monochrome bottle with the shards of the bottle is easily found. 